Hello, I'm Fantastic and Fantastic, and today I'm going to be rolling in the Player's Choice Super Godfest on both of my accounts. So, I like rolling when the rolling rates are in my favor, and with a 54% chance to get any event or any Godfest exclusive card, it is definitely a fantastic time to roll, because many of these featured event cards are unbelievably hard or painful to roll within their respective events, and... Rolling them in here gives me the chance of missing them, so to speak, and getting Godfest exclusives or other rare event cards. Now, without further ado, let the good times roll. So, I am basically just hoping for anything that's new. I There's many things I don't own on both accounts. If it glows, it's usually better. When it doesn't glow, I get a little sad inside, Nephies. Do you have a weapon? Maybe you'll become a weapon one day. Alrighty. That's okay. Remember... Free rolls are not necessarily great, but 54% chance to be happy. I think I'm going to be happy. All right, it's okay. We want them to glow because that means it's seven star or greater and I don't already own it. And that's a good thing because... Oh, fish off, Pantheons. You know what? Maybe, maybe, maybe this will be great. Prim? You know, I don't have a Prim. I don't want to roll an artist because I have way too many of the lower rarity stuff. So you know what? That is great. Prim, I may not necessarily use you in this current form because I feel like they're just stronger things. But you have a pretty cool weapon assist, Prim. Four turns of void, damage void. Pretty nice. Come on, something else new. Conrath, how many do I own on you, Fantastic? Only two, which means I'll have weapon assist. The nice thing about this Pantheon is... These are pretty spicy weapon assists. Like, not many have both cloud and tape at the same time. This one's still pretty cool. Full jam resist if you think about it, and cross. Like, it's just nice to have. Those three pantheons are ugly, unfortunately. But that's okay. This one will have more happiness. There's so many good stuff. And PFS Shark, I have just only started rolling. Lots of duplicates. A five star? What the fish? Another prim! I didn't have a prim and now I have two prims. But you know what? I would always like another Camila. She has another dungeon bonus awakening through super awakenings to bring her up to four. She has a relatively decent sized button as well. So for button farming on like low difficulty stuff when you need dungeon bonuses, she's great to have. I would like to have many more of her. Another Seawolf in Daytona means I can make his cool looking weapon assists. Like, lots of skill boosts, oh sorry, lots of OEs, two TPAs, three turn delay, or this one here, which is full bind immunity if I really cared about that. Either way, three out of five good cards, so to speak. Like, if I get any of these goodies, I'm happy. Okay. self pair Prim, if buff, let's go. <laughs> You're not wrong, Kuro, but I'm not sure. I would probably make one a weapon assist, because it is a pretty unique weapon assist. Hey, glow for me! This is what we roll for, ladies and gentlemen. This type of thing. Big money. Wait, I never got a Raffine on this account? Okay. Why are you here? Why are you not the other 8-star Godfest exclusives? Yeah, why are you here? You can trade for you. What the fish? Oh, yes! Baddies! I like baddies. What the fish, Set? Why is Set here? When is the last time I've used Set? Spoilers, I've never used Set, I think, in like my whole pad life. I don't think I've ever used Set. But it was new and it glowed and it just surprised me. Well, you know what? I like shiny and baddies because they have fantastic weapon assists and i'm hoping that it's a sign that i'll get those kurotobis right because this could be a spicy weapon assist if i really wanted on those teams i still have the metal as well vicious soldier that's probably why i don't have it because i never needed it okay mm -hmm. let's try again fantastic let's hit some better rolls more than 50 percent chance to be happy Yes! I love more flamies and bubblies. Who are you? I can't pronounce your name. Thula. Yeah. You've got fixed movement time, your absorption, your hastes. 
You have healing. Okay. Wait, you don't have a weapon assist? Oh, Sagary. Okay. Well, I never got one, so I guess that's something nice. Do I like your weapon assists? If you're Rainbow, you got kind of a bit of everything. Poison. Two L's. You know what? I will take new things. And that's a Rochi. That's not like Graner. But still, I like Flamey and Bubblies. They have spicy weapons, and now I can make them in different colors. And Vicious Soul just is doing better than you. Deck Nass, I know. Very sad, eh? And Tyler, I do plan to. Never had Sagary before, actually, on this account. I'll probably stop after this pull. This all could be new! What the fish? 54%! What is this nonsense? It'd be nice to get Kuro Tobies and Grand Herbs. Well, this is at least new. I know, right, Yorzu? What the fish? Four Pantheons? These gemstone girls have pretty cool weapon assists that will get buffed in the future, actually. But even right now, they're not bad because they're at least still a delay. Wow, I didn't roll very much on Fantastic when I think about it. Like, I didn't roll particularly well at all. Like, pretty bad, I feel. Ignore the very first one of Nethys, and then these are all my rolls aside from that. So, let's count the Pantheons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen Pantheons. What the fish? Fourteen Pantheons. That is gross. Out of how many rolls? I have way more than 50% Pantheon rolling. That hurts my soul. Pretty poor diversity, actually. Not too many event... Hardly any event cards, actually. It's just Prims. Well, I guess this thing as well. Do I want to roll one more? I do want to roll one more time. I'll just complete the quests I haven't done on this account to get stones. Okay, something new and cool. Get out of here, Lucifer. Glowing is good. PFS Shark, that's exactly what I'm thinking and hoping, right? Hey, I don't have this card. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. A card that people want for their Kurotobi teams. Hey, getting background music, finally. I was hoping to get... My mom rolled so many background music cards. She had, like, outrageous luck. She got three Kurotobis, Granerv, and Yukine. And many more other background music cards. I couldn't believe it. Blackbird, Yogg, glow for me. This is a much better set. I got at least three exciting things. Four exciting things now, technically. So it's the exact opposite. So I evened it out, so to speak. Don't have this card. Five, ten combos. Mm. But look at this. Three skill boosts. What the fish? Momtastic is just like, I want the- I told my mom she wants Kurotobi, and she's like, okay, I rolled three. I'm like, okay. Okay, <laughs> what the fish? Some pretty cool weapon assists, though. For those monocolored teams. Alrighty, fantastic. I want to save some stones for Final Fantasy. Some. Bon, bon -dum. At least it turned it around eventually. Vicious Soldier. I know. She just really wanted it, clearly. Alrighty, Fantastic. So, Fantastic was in the past. We don't think about that. We only think about the great stuff I can roll from here. Remember, 54% chance to be happy. And we're... Ooh, okay. So, I get to have a pad pass roll three times. So this is pretty nice. And deck nest, is that making things extra exciting? Okay, come on. 
Well, pad pass, that was disappointing. I guess I get a Daytona. I have a few of them now, so I guess I can make his weapon assist again since I unmade it. And I think they're getting buffed soon. Well, that was okay. It's alright. Now we spend stones. Like I said, I'm missing quite a few cards in this account. Both accounts are actually missing quite a few cards. I just want to get new things. Yorzu, I saw that too and I thought maybe that could be me. Unfortunately, nothing was new until this moment, but again, new is exciting. Holy fish! Don't have these girls yet! See? I just want background music cards. Pursuit the logic. I do like those. I will play that music one day. But, like, if I wanted a trio of people who have perfect boards every time, maybe. Maybe. But they have interesting weapons. They have so many weapon assists. Look at this! A 10 combo with Team HP and Team RCV. With a delay on top of that. Bulk things for green. Another 10 combo? Like, what the fish? How would they be in super gravity? Let me double check their offensive awakening. That's a lot of our auto healing. Plushy. Wow. So they have 510 combo awakening, so their damage should be pretty high. And you're guaranteed 10 combo boards every time, which is kind of nice. Which is kind of nice. Again, I like getting new stuff. Mei Fang, she has weapon assists. I have enough of them, unfortunately, but they had pretty nice weapon assists. Lavril, I did enjoy the blue one. I don't know why I made I made that a while ago, but this one I've used quite a bit. The Dark Egg, I find quite potent because there are many teams where it's like, I need movement time, but you always need to have lots of team HP, so this is my compromise. And it's also absorption cancellation if... It actually comes up. When I make other eggs, that's two killers. That's interesting. Red tap enhanced teams. If you like Shanna, this could be not a bad option. You want the bulk. You get significantly more damage. Can be a nice option for Shanna teams. I'll probably make her red. That means. Because I do have Shanna, and Clive is coming soon from Final Fantasy. Alrighty! Let's do this again. Chocolate also uses Dark Egg quite a bit. Oh, Run Draw Trio! I like that. They have lots of interesting weapon assists. Like, many of these new God Fist exclusives have pretty cool weapon assists. This is something I didn't have, and I wanted them for a while just because I didn't have it. <laughs> like, they are technically something, in a sense, but... I... Yeah. Not my particular jam for usage. i rather have this blue weapon assist. It's quite powerful on mono blue teams. Like, you get bulk, you get skill boost, you get a bunch of OEs. There is haste. I'm making a weapon. Lots of dark teams, but yeah. Holy fish! I finally did it! I got a great five pull. It's beautiful. Look at all these Remdraw trios. I'm gonna make all the weapon assists, or maybe actually use them as a leader and pretend Rainbow's cool again. But look at that! Damage! Remdraw trio. Woo! Two seven combos. What the fish? Well, it, maybe it's time for me to actually play them as a leader. I haven't played Rainbow in so long. You want those trios so bad? I have another Seawolf Daytona, so that means I can have another weapon assist if I really wanted. Yeah, Mantastic's rolling better, for sure. Remdraw team, please. I don't know what to put on it still. Okay, could this be magic as well? A bunch of new cards? No, Pandora. Sena! Oh, Lawrence! Yes, Lawrence! I always made fun of you, but I kind of like you. But you also have a great web fish. Lawrence also has a great weapon assist for aggregate teams. Like, this is pretty spicy as a weapon assist for aggregate teams. This is a bunch of healing potential as well. 
I feel like Lawrence is like, I want him to be cool. And I have many Senas, but you know what? I can always have more. I will probably make it, I don't know, would I make another blue one? Maybe. Like, I have Shanna. I have no real interest in running him as a sub. Like, Shanna doesn't need you. So it's like, maybe I make you another big button. Dirty one wants me to build a trio. Okay, let's do that again, ladies and gentlemen. But Sena is in a spectacular role. Basically, every form is good. A Yukine number so- What the fish, Cotton? I can make a new shirt. I have way too many Yukines. I don't know how, but I like to roll the same card multiple times. Like, what the fish do I do with all these? Can you please give her new evolutions? And too many Mei Fangs. But you know what? They're all trade fodder if absolutely necessary. But I like the color scheme. It's all blue and white. Oh, blue and yellow. Like, it's at least an aesthetic color scheme, right? I could have a systems of Yukine. That's completely useless. Try that again. I want some more background music cards. But there's still some things I don't have, but obviously. Ooh, can some glow for me? Because that's Pantheon. This is glowing, glowing is good. That's why I don't like Pantheon cards look like the same as something new that glows. Oh yeah! Something I don't have. Other two healer girl twins. Well not twins, but. Big meaty weapon assist for their respective color teams. Like, even for, like, Shanna teams, if you think about it, it's two turns of haste, a bunch of OEs, two skill, skill boosts, and two team HPs. Kind of all the stuff you really want, really. Like, I feel like two team HPs is kind of the minimum. Fish off! Well, four Pantheons makes me sad. Mm -hmm. Let's do one more. Chocolate get playing with my emotions. Oh, fish. Okay, come on, big money. Come on, hopefully some of these glow. Stop being Pantheon! Jeez, that is painful. I don't need more of these Euras. Why are you not Ryume? I wish you were Ryu Is Ryume from this series? I feel like he is. I want Ryume, I don't have Ryume. <laughs> Yorazu says one more pull will make up for it. I still at least got more new stuff. Curl, that makes me sad then. Come on, big money. A bunch of duplicates. Glow! Holy fish! It's getting worse. Because I don't have Patty Vicious Soldier, and it's just one of the better options. Because it's the meta is kind the meta is kind of like Team HP or Bust Vicious Soldier. Blue Cross says you give me your luck. Wow. Next one for sure says THI. Fasty X says can't believe I still stream Pat. Remember when I first started streaming? Well, welcome back to the stream, Fasty X. Yorzu, the last 10 pulls were truly disheartening. I agree. There was one high moment earlier. Okay. Critters are always one pull away from jackpot, says Oddbert. Oh, wow. I have budget patty. You mean like the girl from the last collab? Like, really budget patty that doesn't even bring the L? Okay. One more five pull, because that's what everyone would say to do. Because more rolling is good. I found a squishy ball. Okay. We're going to squeeze the ball. Come on. Whoop. Oh, fish. Don't be Pantheon. I like the silver. Don't have many of him. Glowing is a good sign. It means I don't have it. Okay, Sandra. I feel like you could might be rainbowy. But you know what? Background music is good. Deck Nasty, you think of all the possible stuff you could potentially get alongside of it. 
Sandra is rainbow oriented. She does do damage absorption. It is something you need. Sandra saves me from buying the bundle. You know what, bundle, like, getting background music cards is great. Oh yes, Kurum! More weapon assist options, because they have so many weapon assists! Like this parasol, who, like, you want a 10 combo? You get a 10 combo. You want a plushie for mono wood? You can have a plushie. I could have a bonito. VDPing if I wanted. I still don't have Flamian Bubbly, I just realized. That's very sad. Yours who says this is a good one to end on. This is pretty great when you think about it. Four out of five is pretty darn good. Like, four out of five, like, that's 80%. Like, that's a good amount. Like, I think Silvert has pretty great weapon assist potentially. Like, that's, a, that's five Water Rows and two Team HPs. It's got... Combo or God Killer. Like, they're interesting weapon assists. This series has strong weapons, I feel. So, yeah. I feel like I can end pretty happily on this. Like, I got most of the cards, I'd say. Like, let me take a look what I don't even have. Yep, I got the Canna Corone. Don't have Flamey, Bubbly. I got the Mermaid. I got the Ruka. I already own Valyria and Ideal, Laveral. Didn't get more shinies and baddies, unfortunately. Didn't get the Bloblets and a Leezer. Like, I've got most of the cards, I'd say. Like, I got most of the cards, to be honest. Like, rolling for more, is that truly necessary? I already own, I already have Kurotobi, is the thing. So I don't need to, like, roll as desperately. I do have Granerv as well. So, I feel like that's a pretty good place to stop. Like, if we look at... Like, it got better at the end. There is a bunch of sadness in the middle. There's a bunch of cottons as well, so I can make a nice t-shirt. But I've got a bunch of these now, so I guess I should actually build a team for that. Yeah, like, pretty happy overall. Like, got almost everything that I am missing for the most part. So, yeah. Hopefully, this video gives you some insights what you could roll. It is a good time to roll because I like it when the odds are high. And the odds are 54% chance of getting something of value. Because even if you get another 6-star Godfist exclusive that you already own, it is still trade fodder at the very worst. So, you can utilize that in other places. Because that's what kind of what Godfest used to be for. So... It is definitely a good time to roll, and hopefully all you lovely ladies and gentlemen out there in the audience have just a magical time rolling as I did, and happy puzzling. <laughs>